it has changed and changing a lot because uh, we are more and more living in a shared world. It means people are not buying things, they are using services as a shared services and including the uh, electric mobility and all these things. I mean, it's, a, it's not an evolution, it's a revolution we can see these days. As I mentioned before, I believe before people have bought a car or a bike or whatever and, and today they are buying a service. And this it looks a little bit more like as a flat. That means they are buying in for mobility as a flat, a monthly fee. And this is including all in the future. This is including as a shared service, public transport, it could be a taxi or whatever is coming up. I believe this is a mega trend over the next five to ten years. It's a very good question. Uh, what I've learned in the last three years here in India is that many global uh, people or companies are coming in and try to sell US or European technology to India. That doesn't work. So that means uh, it doesn't work technology-wise because you have national rooming and many, many special things and also from the price point. This is the reason why India has changed many things. They are starting to developing their own devices, their own edge technology. So, and you can see a clear trend that sooner or later uh, the India technology is ready for the global market. Of course, it's very simple. If it works in India from the price point and the technology point, you also can sell it around the world. This is my impression. And we are on the best way to make it happen here in India, for India and the global market. Yeah, first of all, technology is only enabling things. Uh, 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 it shouldn't be a driver. Uh, uh, I believe technology-wise we can solve many of the problems. Uh, we have to think much more uh, the customer experience. Why a customer would pay for this? What, how he wants to pay? Is it a one-time fee? Is it a subscription-based uh, price point? I believe here uh, we have to think about and then select the right technology. The important one is uh, many new technologies are coming up. And uh, from the architecture, what, uh, from the IT architecture on the back end, we have to be ready for this. It means you need a very open architecture that you can plug in any new technology as soon as possible. Open APIs, I believe, I only can underline this word again and again and again. It's very interesting. I like it because uh, you need uh, uh, the community. You need the community to talk because you cannot solve problems alone. It's, today we are talking about the partner ecosystem, uh, which is increasing more and more. It's not only the manufacturer of the car, it's also the entertainment in the car, uh, how to measure traffic jam uh, in the future, uh, how to, 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 to analyze data. You're getting a lot of data uh, from a car, from the driver behavior, from the car itself, and, and all these things are coming together. And this is uh, the, it's wonderful to be here and to see how many experts are here and, and really top experts who are knowing exactly what they are doing and bringing people together. It's very wonderful to be here and to have the chance to be on the panel. Uh, key takeaways for me, it's really, um, we have all the same problems uh, uh, to make it really happen for India, uh, but uh, we are faster and faster uh, and uh, we, we, are, we are executing. It's not, we are, today we are not thinking how to make it happen, Today we're thinking, let's execute it, let's make it happen. It's really the, the, the wish, not the wishes, and also not the pressure. The people are willing to do this and to, to, to make uh, India as one of the driver for all these things. And uh, it's great to be here.